They were working on a smaller scale, and I certainly did that. Hey, this is Carrie with Canary Quilts, and this is day two of week two of the 30 Days of Improv Quilt Along. And last week we worked with squares and rectangles, this week we're working with polygons. So they give you tips for each day to kind of help get you started. Um, you certainly don't have to follow them, but it does help to like kind of guide you through this process of building a block. So yesterday they said start with a shape and build around it. They said um, pick a shape and start working in smaller pieces with it. It just gets you working with the smaller pieces and the seams and how is it going to turn out in the end. Um, and I certainly did that. I got some small pieces in there. So I, what did I, I started with a six sided shape and I don't think I have any six sided shapes in here. So uh, it, it just kind of ended up being what it is. And I did one half and then I was like, I don't know where this is going. So I built this half and then just put them together. So it still turned out great. I mean, there is no right or wrong in improv quilting. So, I mean, it's fun. It really makes you think. You have to work around these angles. And so that helps to translate to when you do get a pattern and you see something that you're not familiar with. It just helps you draw from this experience of just kind of winging it and working with angles. So. If you're new here and uh, you want to follow along on this 30 days, it's every Monday through Friday for the month of August 2022. And uh, this week we're working with polygons. So hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell, and you'll get notified when I put out another block in the 30 days of improv quilt along. So let's get started.
more difficult than I expected. Tried to work with small pieces. I tried to work with a six-sided shape and it just kept sending me in all directions. So that's kind of what I ended up with. I don't think I have a six-sided shape in there, but that's what I did start with. <laughs> so um, there you go. This is day two of week two, or day seven of the 30 days of improv quilt along. Working with polygons this week, and on day two, they suggested you start working with smaller pieces. So that's what I did. I tried a new shape, a, um, the hexagon. It was difficult. It, it was a real thinker trying to build that block out. So I kind of got this half done and then I just moved over to this half and started building that out till I could put them together. Um, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell, you get notified when I put up my next block. And it was fun putting this video together. It was fun putting the block together, but it was a real thinker. So uh, I hope you enjoyed it. I enjoyed making it. Thank you very much for watching this video. And we'll see you in the next one.